Hi everyone, here's a quick video introducing a really neat tool called Zoom Instant Messaging Chat for Teams. Search for Zoom in your search bar here. You should see Zoom app. So if you click on that button, you're going to get a window open here. So this is your Zoom account. If you haven't signed in, you can sign in on this window here. And you notice that there are four options here at the top. So this video is going to cover the Zoom chat feature. This is a really great feature for teams, for programs, for groups of colleagues, faculty working together um, to be able to stay in touch during this uh, remote teaching. So, um, just an overview here of the Zoom chat options. We've got starred messages, contact requests, files, and then you can add people here to your list. So right now I've got all of my colleagues on the Teaching and Learning Hub team. And we also have a group uh, message here for the entire Hub team. So these ones here are individual. So if you see a name here, I can individually message someone or uh, we can message the entire team here as a group. The other thing too is you can add folks to your list. So here if you click search, um, I can search for another colleague. Um, I'll just look for uh, someone that I already have on here. So Danielle, um, I can click her name and if I click on her, I can add her to my list of people here to contact. Um, and then you'll notice here it's kind of like an instant messaging system. Um, you can star messages. So if I click star, I go into my starred messages and you'll see that um, there are messages here that are saved. So you can save important, um, you know, documents, links, anything that your team shares with you. And back at my hub team here, you can also share files, screenshots, there's uh, emojis as well. So it's just a nice way to stay in touch with everybody uh, on your team or, um, you know, folks that you need to be in touch with on a regular basis uh, throughout this time. So if you have any questions at all, please reach out to the Teaching and Learning Innovation Hub.